Hello people, I am Inali Dhyani, third year medical student of Government Dune Medical College, Dehradun. And today at Analytical Minds, I am going to tell you about the life in Government Dune Medical College. And uh, so there is so much to share to you. So let's start with the video at once. So I'm going to talk about the first year at the college. So uh, our whole first month is of foundation course. So on the very first day, we were given a brief introduction about the curriculum and, and we were told that what are the responsibilities of a future doctor is. Our respected dean, he also enlightened uh, about that how the MBBS life is different from other professional degrees in terms of academics, the social life, the income, the settlements, everything. Then next, for our, for our college campus too, one of our very respected teacher, he lead us uh, to introduce the different departments of our college like the anatomy department, the biochemistry, the physiology department and so on. So yeah, uh, this is all about my first day at the college. So now I'm gonna tell you about that how my college is different from other colleges. First of all, its location. It is located in Dehradun, one of the famous city of India. And also you know that Dehradun is the capital of Uttarakhand. Secondly, that Masuri, Rishikesh, they are so near to it. So you can visit there with your friends. Also, there are so many cafes, malls. So you will never get bored here. Now let's talk about the curriculum. It is competency-based undergraduate curriculum, which is implemented from August 2019, that is from our batch, MBBS batch 2019. It includes uh, the foundation course, um, the early clinical exposure, uh, maintaining logbooks, ADCOM, attitude, ethics and communication, etc. So now let's talk about the teaching faculty. The teaching faculty in the college is amazing. There are professors from old and reputed colleges with amazing experiences. And I can assure you that you will gain a lot if you are interested. And uh, uh, they are friendly, they are strict at the same time and they are caring too. So now let's talk about the campus. Our campus is not too large nor too small. It is sufficient for the students to roam around and our campus includes the basketball court the volleyball court we have different gyms for boys and girls and we have a canteen also so yeah this is all about our campus so now let's talk about the dress code so there is no such dress code in the hostel but in the college you have to be properly dressed for boys there is a shirt and a trouser and a white apron and for girls you have to wear salwar suit with a white apron so now let's talk about the patient load the patient load in the hospital is amazing. You will find every kind of patient in the hospital and I assure you that you will learn a lot here. So now let's talk about the hostel life. I'm a hostler and one room is shared by three girls and everyone is provided with an almira, a bed, a table and a chair. Yes, we have the common washrooms but there's nothing to be worried about. They're well maintained. Uh, we have a study area in our hostel and uh, not talking about the mess food, uh, it is not so good, but it is not like uh, the homemade food, but yeah, it is eatable. And there are some days where you are provided with your favorite food. So yeah, this is all about our hostel. So now let's talk about the senior junior relationship in our college. The senior junior relationship is very healthy. The seniors are very friendly. They are always helpful to you. They will guide you at every point. They will tell you that what is important and what is not important to study and uh, they will teach you the whole night before the practical exams. So this is all about the senior junior relationship. So now about the fee structure, it is 1,45,000 per year with no bond. So now let's talk about the fest. Every year we have a sport fest that is Phoenix and the cultural fest that is Fornix. The students from other medical colleges, they're also invited and uh, it is celebrated like a festival in our college. So yeah, this is all about my college. And at last, I want to give advice to my juniors who will join the college in the upcoming years is that be courageous, be confident, and there's nothing to be worried. We, the seniors, your seniors, we are always there to help you out. And yeah, see you soon.